The awards night of the 10th Cinemalaya Philippine Independent Film Festival on August 10 was marred by controversy when competition films for 2012 and 2013 were uploaded on the festival website and video sharing site YouTube without the consent of the filmmakers. Cinemalaya officials were quick to remedy the situation, pulling down the videos and giving a public apology. What's going to happen to Cinemalaya in the next 10 years? My answer is, I don't really know, because the main issue of Cinemalaya now is sustainability. Unless we are able to find a long-term solution to this matter, it is going to be very difficult to predict the future. Towards this end, we wish to publicly apologize to the filmmakers and producers of Patch 2012 and 2013 for the uploading of their films on YouTube. The said films have been removed last night and we are calling for a dialogue to discuss and settle the issue. Again, our deep apologies. Cinemalaya Foundation Chairman Tony Boy Kowanko said the uploading of videos was meant to help market the festival and its films. Successful as it may seem because we no longer can fit more in the audience. It's really not that big. And the cash flow from ticket sales will not be enough to sustain the expenses of the festival going forward. Um, why did we put it on YouTube? Because it was for free. My apologies again and uh, hopefully we're able to solve this problem. And to see my, my film, our films in YouTube is a violation of our rights as artists and as filmmakers. So, this is a wake-up call for the Cinemalaya Foundation and the filmmakers to have a dialogue and to, for filmmakers to unite. We filmmakers create films because we love Philippine cinema, because of our passion, not because of money nor fame. Best actress Nora Honor also gave her two cents worth on the matter. Hindi ang unang una siguro magpaalam muna sila. Sa mga director lalong-lalo na kasi sila yung nagpagod diyan eh. Ah, at saka siya pre producer. Okay, mga producers. Kasi para bang para bang ano yan eh. Ah, hindi naman sa iyo kinuha mo yung ano parang nako na rin yun eh para sa akin. Na 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 pinalabas niyo nang walang paalam. Hindi tama. The evening ended with a call for respect from Francis Pachon, who won the Best Film Award for Boya. It pains me if, um, if my fellow filmmakers also you know, attack Cinemalaya and all that. And the word lang na nasa isip ko is respect. Uh, Cinemalaya must respect the filmmakers, and filmmakers must respect Cinemalaya. This is Christine Sabilio reporting for Inquire.net.